Maya woman there. You will be known and called Melissa. My princess. We are happy for you today because you have brought a man from the human world as your husband, as has been our tradition. Samadura, we have waited for you to bring a husband from the human world. You have constantly disappointed us. Your little sister has done it. What a shame. Princess, congratulations. Mommy is right. We can only delay a good idea. We cannot prevent it. Getting a good husband is a good idea. Which woman does not want to be loved? If my little sister can bring a man from the human world, I, Samadora, can do it.
are troubled. What is the matter? It is my wife. What has she done to you? <coughs> She's running around with some good for nothing boys. As if that is nothing enough. She spends my own money to service and keep them. Eh? Honestly, I would have divorced her before now. But it is impossible. Because it will pitch me against my children. What do you want me to do for you? Please, you have to do something. Something must be done. <clears throat> there are two things I can do for you. First, I can kill her interest in other man so that she will love only you. Secondly, we can disgrace her so that the next time she sleeps with another man she will learn a very bitter lesson. Which do you choose? I, I want you to do something that will make her love only me. That is what marriage is all about. But I, no, I want her to be punished. Disgrace. I mean, it would be a pity if she does all these things and gets away with them now. I, I want her to be disgraced. Gods, my ancestors, nobody holds the cow by the horn while another makes it. When a tree is about to be cut down, it stands still. But if a human being is in danger, he walks away. If she has walked away from danger, let the tree not be caught. But if she dares death in the face, let her reap what she has sown. Take this. It's only you that can touch it. somewhere where she can walk across it so that the next time she sleeps with another man the gods will fight yes but this is only a, a broom it is highly potent the elephant is too big to hide behind the tree uh, thank you wise one but I, I hope it will not kill her because that is not what I, I want go Now on, 
I am going to stop resisting her advances. Are you out of your mind, Simon? For God's sake, Mrs. Davis is a married woman and you know it! Go on, preacher man. Go on and preach to me. You who sleep with anything in skirts. Go on and preach to me. Yes. Yes, Simon. I sleep with anything in skirts. But for God's sake, let's be reasonable. Simon, we can't sing so long to survive. Not a married woman. No! There must be a way out. For God's sake, Simon. Simon, Mrs. Davis is not good for any young man like you and me. Forget about her money. Her husband's money. What do I say, What should we have for her husband's money? I know Mrs. Davis is married. But she's the only way out now. There are many beautiful girls out there. Don't do this. Don't look in. You go and get them. I am going to get money.
Oh, look at you. Hi, pretty. Are you going my way? I don't think so. Uh-oh. <laughs> so tell me, where are you going? I'm going my way. Your way? Okay, hop in. I'll drop you anywhere, wherever. Wherever? Are you sure? Cross my heart. <laughs> Come on, let's go. By the way, uh, the name is Ken. What's your beautiful name? I am Queen. Wow, Queen. <laughs> That's a beautiful name you got there. So, your parents certainly knew what they were up to when they gave you that name. Queen Samadara. Queen Samadara. <laughs> First Queen, now Samadara. <laughs> You're really beautiful by any standard. I mean it, yes, yes. And uh, it would be a disservice to let you go like that, you know. One doesn't meet a type two times in a year. <laughs> <laughs> Most people claim they don't meet my type in all their lifetime. You know what, Samadora? I feel so blessed to have met you today. Why? Yeah, because I've been, I've been feeling very depressed all day. You know? I was actually driving to nowhere. But now that I've found you, I have reason to drive to somewhere. Yes, <laughs> you drive into my way. Oh, come on, Samadora. Why don't we drive to my way? Uh huh. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Shines like the early morning sun. You only have to taste her to know what she's like. Maybe it's the way she walks. Oh, Simon, that was so, so, so good. I knew you were going to enjoy it. Yes, I enjoyed it. Mm. Mm. Get that address for a little while, okay? All right, all Please right. Do. Mm. Mm -hmm. 
You seem to enjoy playing around with women. No, Samadhan. I am not playing games with you. I mean every word of what I say to you. So be it. Someone is dead. It's impossible. He died last night on top of a woman. What? A woman? Yes, Kenny. Simon died on top of a woman last night. Never dress well. Always have a one button this. That's why I have you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
She's not yet married to ah, Come on, come on, Becky, listen to me. Becky, listen. Mm -hmm. Those were days of our grandmothers, not even our mothers. You never get seriously, at least for once. Well, such is life. <laughs> Hell! Look, we'll have to run off. Come on, quickly, quickly, let's get out. You're gonna finish your dream. Oh, you can help me with it. Of course I will. <laughs> Please sit down. What can I do for you? Is that how to welcome your love? That's very ungrateful of you. Young lady, please. As you can see, I'm a very busy man. And there are several clients waiting for me out there. Can we just go straight to the point? Can't you remember me? No, I can't. <clears throat> my mission is to take you to my kingdom to marry you. You promised to be my husband forever, remember? That was our agreement. You are making a big mistake. Now, can you leave my office? You don't talk to me like that. I made you rich. Now listen, now listen good. If you don't have any business to discuss with me, now get out of my office or else I'm calling the guards. You? If I have the powers to make you rich overnight, don't you think I'm a wonderful person? Anyway, I'll leave you for now. I'll come at the right time. What's keeping this women? Are 
Anyway, they're here. I just wanted to be sure you're in line. See you soon. talk to you right now. Lady? Come on, Becky, there's no lady anywhere. But we heard you, Kenny. Didn't you, Rita? Yes, Kenny, we heard her. And we heard you call her evil. Don't be a sports sport. I was only taking lines from a play I read years ago. And the woman's voice, were you acting that For too? God's sake, Becky, there is no woman anywhere. You have satisfied your curiosity. Can we go now? for me. Uh, we are strictly talking about ladies. Why ladies? <laughs> because guys just don't simply have taste. Yes. I take that as an insult. Sam, I want that dress. Ken. Kenny. Yes. We're talking about a dress we saw yesterday. And we love that dress. I want the dress. I'll buy it for you. You're buying for her. Rita, I'll buy it for you. This place is exotic. Eating you. Okay? Yep. You've been so far away. Same thing, the matter. Nothing, son. Just juggling some figures in my head, that's all. I'm okay. Well, I'll take that to mean you don't want to talk about it. to renew our love.
killed somebody, Ken. No, Becky. Yes, that was exactly what you were doing. It was certainly a dream, Becky. Exactly. Becky, it was certainly a dream. Becky. Becky, it was a dream. <laughs> Serious. Can you believe that last night while we were sleeping, Ken was making love to someone? He don't say, Becky. Could she be the same person he was talking to yesterday? I don't know. But he was making love to this person as if he was in real life. I've never been so scared. Becky, but that's not so serious. Ordinarily, you've seen so. There's something unusual about this experience. The atmosphere was so uncanny. Then I could feel their movement. And then he even tried to lie about it. That was what annoyed me the most. Does he belong to a secret society? Oh no, Becky. There's nothing men would not do to make money these days. Oh no, Rita. At least I know he gets his money through big government contracts. All the same, Becky, something is obviously wrong. Even yesterday in the restaurant, he was not himself. I'm so scared. Becky, this is not a time to get scared. This is a time to move if you must get married next month. Something has to be done. Do you understand? That is how it is, Baba. All right. Honorific to the Tatibus. Honorific to the Tatibus. To the Nitatibus. To the Nitatibus. Ha 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 That is his picture. Look at it. What is his name? Kenneth. Um, Kenneth Obiaku. Kenneth, son of Obiaku. Okunoptomi, son of a woman. Tell it all to me. Yes. Yes. I see. Oh, I see. <laughs> Young ladies, why are you bothering yourself? He is betrothed to a goddess of the sea. Yes, he has a relationship with the goddess of the sea. He went into that relationship without knowing what he was going into. Baba, we are getting married next month. Mm. And we love each other. <laughs> that will be difficult. Very difficult. She is a powerful goddess of the ocean. And she is guided by powerful forces. Baba, Baba, is there nothing you can do to help us? <laughs> tough. Very tough. 
but it can be done. If only you can bring him here. <laughs> <laughs> my mommy. Hello. Yes. Uh, I thought you said we weren't coming to leave. Oh, something cropped up. Oh. So how are you? I'm fine. You know what? Uh, I've been busy all morning. Really? You know, so I just instructed my secretary that I do not want to see anybody. Yeah. So I just dozed off on the studio. <laughs> Kenny, look, this is a very serious matter, and I plead that we handle it very seriously. Becky, can you get to the point? Kenny, do you love me enough to want to marry me? <laughs> Becky, I thought we were getting married next month. Tell me the truth, Kenny. Do you have any connection with any water spirit? I don't understand what you're talking about. Kenny. You know, after last night's incident, I decided to consult a spiritualist. A spiritualist? Over me? Becky, you are out of your mind. Kenny, it's for our own good. And you better confide in me so that I can help Oh, you. shut up! It's you who need help. If after all your education, you still believe such nonsense! You know this is not nonsense, Kenny. business discussion with this lady. Can you just wait outside for a moment, please? You must be out of your mind. I am not going anywhere. No, please, Becky, try and understand. Understand what? Hmm? Now listen, Becky. This is my office. And I decide what goes on here. Now can you excuse me? How did you get in here? Stupid question. I can get anywhere I want to at any time. Now get out. I said get My husband, stop behaving like a child. And we will live happily forever in my kingdom. Let me keep this for you in the meantime. That bitch can be having my phone. When you wake up, I'll come back for you. Tomorrow is our wedding. We can't keep the guest with you.
that they want. want. That that one wants to wait, 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 now, now, let, let me, me teach you a lesson. lesson. Same question two nights ago at the restaurant. Now it's my turn to ask. Why are you asking, Sam? I think I know you. I don't believe you belong to any secret society. But, Bunny, I don't know anymore. Why, Sam? See, something strange happened in my house last night. A strange woman. Came to warn Rita to leave you alone. Rita even talked about how she and Becky had gone to see a spiritualist over you. So, I'm going to be very frank with you. This whole thing is beyond me. I have a very strong feeling that we are being used by some forces. And that's why I've always told you to give your life to Christ. There he goes again. That's the only solution out of this evil past. Come to church. For God's sake, Sam, I've always told you I am not cut up for that trust, man.
I don't know what's going on with you anymore. Becky, I am sorry. Please forgive me. You know all this about business and appointments. Sorry. It won't repeat itself again. I promise you. Just relax. Let me go get you your dinner, okay? Just relax, okay? Okay. But I like me afresh with the Holy Spirit in my elements, so as I bring out of my spirit with flow, rivers of living waters. It's written that whatever we lose here on earth we will lose in heaven. Whatever we burn in on earth will be burned in heaven. Okay, Sharia Maman will be asked. Who near the Astangian to all the Lord? And he has given me the power to travel upon serpents and scorpions. And you say that this child will be in the mighty name of Jesus. Satan, you have no power over this world. We will never come here for man is this. I don't care. We will never come here for and throw the form of prophet. You have no power over this one. This is the Son of God. I'm covering him with the blood of Jesus.
everything out. Do you feel things? No, doctor. Any pains? Okay, get up. There is no cause for alarm. Stress can sometimes cause your manhood to <laughs> back up. To use the expressions. Doctor, I tried it again this morning. And the same old story happened. Please, sit down. It's like the, the old boy was just there looking dead. Could not even acknowledge the presence of a woman, Doctor. It might just be a psychological problem. Now tell me something. Have you been through some unusual kind of stress this week? Mm, yes, but... That is it. That is just it. Now listen, Ken. You are a perfectly virile young man. All you need is rest. You know something else? By the time you are properly rested, the problems will be over before you know it. Look, doctor. I am wearing the shoes, and I know where it pinches most. I know what I am talking about. Kenny, there is nothing wrong with you. Don't you understand? Honorific ability to the the to Dinitatibus, to Dinitatibus, <laughs> to <laughs> you. Yes, it's me, you're right. Why are you disturbing me? You are evil. You are evil. Let the young man be. No, I won't, and I won't let him be either. <laughs> Finally, I agreed to go with the spiritualist. I'm making fun of you. How did you go? Ah, it was not easy. At first, it was fire, but just guess how I clinched it. How? You see, last night his his thing could not get up. He could not perform. Becky, why are you grinning? It's not a laughing matter. The world is full of mysteries. <laughs> so, Peter, are you coming out, Beck? You know, I told him that you don't have to be there the first time. Oh, Becky. Becky, I'm sorry I can't. So many things I have to do. Peter. Peter. Sam thinks I'm evil. All because I took you to the spiritualist without informing him. Oh, and the coughing issue has not made matters easy at all. Becky, I'm, I'm 
I'm afraid I'm going to lose him. Talk like that, Rita. Sam is never going to do a thing like that. I know it. He loves you. She came from nowhere to torment my life. I am not tormenting your life. You are the one tormenting my life. You promised to marry me. I made you rich. That was our agreement. Kenny, is it true? It's not true, Becky. She does not know what she's saying. It's not true. Anyway. I don't know about all that. He's my friend, and I'm not going to let you take him away from me. You cannot. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Young lady, I'll give you a chance to get out of here now, or else you end up like me. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Whatever powers you have, I am not going to stand here and watch you take my husband away from me. Oh, you are daring me. Yes, I am. Becky, no, Becky, 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 Becky. Oh, please, please. Becky, look, I'll do anything. I'll do anything anyway, but just don't kill my Becky for me, please. She is a stubborn little bitch. Anyway, don't worry. She won't die. Come, let's go. <laughs> but where are you taking me to? To the Atlantic. The guests are waiting. They have set your table and they are going to lay a red carpet yeah. for you. But how can I follow you to the ocean? Why do you ask me such questions when you already know my powers? Don't take me away from this world. It's the only world I know. I beg you, please. There's nothing in this world compared to my kingdom. There, everything is free. Come. Come. Let's go. You won't regret it. Come. Please, no. Please, don't leave.
Okay, I'm sorry. I now know you're not evil. Where are you coming from? Ken's office. Did you see him? No. The secretary said he's not been to the office today. What about yesterday? Yes. But he's hedgy. He didn't see anything coming out. I mean, it's obvious that he's scared about something. Anyway, Becky was here this morning. It seems Kenny has agreed to go to the spiritualist at last. How could he do a thing like that? I told him the church was the only answer. Oh, Kenny. How did you get yourself into this? How? Why must all my friends end up in trouble? First, it was Simon dying on top of a woman. Now, Kenny signing a pact with a goddess. Calm down, Sammy. Calm down. God is wonderful, you know. And there's nothing beyond him. I have this, this feeling, this belief that Kenny will overcome. Sammy. Remember we have a deliverance service in church today. And we are almost late. Sit down while I go and get dressed. I wouldn't take one, okay?
Run, run, run to the river. Tell him to be some power. Be some power. Run, run very fast. Samadora so late. You know, it's not easy dealing with humans out there. They're usually very stupid and lily livered. of entertainment programming from the comfort of your home through our satellite delivered channels in your favorite languages French, English, Swahili, Sri, Igbo, Hausa, Yoruba and so on. Afarevo Dubbing Services With the largest number of dubbing studios in Africa we can help you dub your videos to major languages in Africa Swahili, English, French, Yoruba, Hausa, Igbo, Wolof, Zulu and so on. Afarevo YouTube, the largest YouTube partner in Africa with over 500 channels of top African entertainment and millions of eyeballs daily. We help thousands of video creators make money on YouTube. Afarevo, the revolution is on. 